Jessica Moroni reveals Meghan Markle constantly FaceTimes and checks up on her, dismissing claims the pair have grown apart following her racism row. Jessica Moroni has revealed she and Meghan Markle are still in constant contact, undermining claims the pair have grown apart following the stylist's racism row this summer. Speaking to Page Six, Jessica, 40, who lives in Toronto, said Meghan, 39, constantly fast times and checks up on me from her home in Santa Barbara. It was claimed in August that the Duchess of Sussex had cut ties with the stylist after black influencer Sasha Exeter accused her of threatening her livelihood after taking offense at a Black Lives Matter video posted by the online star. As her life fell apart, Jessica faced public accusations that she used the Duchess of Sussex as her superpower. But Jessica insisted that the opposite was true and she refused to speak about her royal BFF on air, even when she was asked. Canadian broadcaster, CTV would ask me to go on shows and talk about Meghan, I refused, Moroni told the publication. I don't call that a superpower. I call it protecting my friend. Commenting on their relationship, an unnamed source said, Their friendship is not what it was once, but it's not because of Exeter. They've just grown apart. Of course, Meghan has been worried about Jess. She'll always have love for her. Jessica confirmed the pair are still in regular contact, suggesting they remain close behind the scenes. Jessica and Meghan have been close friends for years with the stylist's daughter a bridesmaid and Brian and his twin John serving as page boys at the Duchess's wedding to Prince Harry. Finding Freedom, the explosive biography about the Sussexes written by journalists Omid Scobie and Carolyn Durand, recently shed light on the history of Jessica's friendship with the Duchess. It told how Meghan and Harry spent time with the Moronis, part of the Canadian political dynasty before their relationship was made public in 2016, and hid out at the family home when the news first broke. It was there, the authors claim, that Meghan fell hard for her now husband after getting a first-hand glimpse of how Harry might be as a father.